video tonight showing the absolute destruction of a house in Draper. The newly built home slid down the mountainside late Friday night. The garage door now standing separate on the edge of a pit, getting plenty of attention from neighbors. The owners had not lived in that home since October. In fact, they were the subject of a KSL investigation about several new homes that were not holding up like they were supposed to. It's one of many impacts we're seeing across the Wasatch Front as snow melt leads to damaging flooding and slides filled with snow, mud, and debris. This home getting ripped apart might be the most destructive yet. From Chopper 5, we tried to understand what happened to the ground beneath it. That's a long ride. For a big house. It doesn't take an expert to marvel at the devastation caused when the land gave out from under this Draper home this weekend. Well, this area is known to have really large landslides, really slow moving landslides. But to understand what may have caused this, we took an expert up in Chopper 5 above the slide. Utah Department of Natural Resources geologist Ben Erickson. The material is just really conducive for that. It's uh, volcanic ash. That was deposited here about 35 million years ago. We saw evidence from Chopper 5 of more nearby landslides, but none like the one that took out this previously condemned home. A lot of areas are prime real estate because of the views they have. But Erickson says slopes like this can complicate the equation for engineers trying to achieve a safety factor in their builds. Based off of the geotechnical data that they had, they would establish what was needed to make it stable to add more material to it to uh, extend, extend out the, the building pads and then also allow the, the homes to be built on. Unfortunately, uh, the plans they, they went with uh, didn't work out. Among the evidence Ben sees of landslide risk, cracks at the base of the slope. Suggesting that there's stresses there that are trying to be relieved at the surface uh, because there's a weight uh, that's pulling it apart, forming those cracks. Erickson urges caution around this and any other landslide area where the ground is unstable. Just respect the, the safety parameters that are being put in place uh, to protect uh, the, anybody that goes near it or is uh, curious about it.